Hi, Stan. Hi. Uh, I know it feels so uncomfortable for you to be sitting here talking on a video camera. Uh, tell me a little bit about yourself. What do you do for a living? And uh, you know, My name's uh, Stanley Anderson, and I'm a uh, owner of a construction company. Uh -huh. and I actually go out and do the work out in the field. You have a backhoe company? Yeah, we have uh, a backhoe utility business. I see. Putting uh, pipes in the ground and stuff like that. Yeah, you and Lynn own the company. And Lynn and I, my wife, owns the company, and we have a couple employees. And, uh, Your son works with you too? Yes. Huh. Well, good. Uh, tell us about what brought you to our office. Uh, I was uh, having uh, ear pain. Mm -hmm. This uh, was back in, this is May of 2013. Is this about a year ago? About a year ago, I went to my uh, family doctor because mm -hmm. my uh, jaw was constantly hurting. This is Dr. Kimball? Yeah, uh -huh. uh, Dr. Kimball is a dull pain. Mm -hmm. and, and whereabouts uh, was it? Would you point That out? was right here on the right side, right at the joint. Uh -huh. And uh, he said, well, it's probably from uh, clenching, was what was he was thinking. And mm -hmm. so then I went to uh, our dentist. Family dentist. Regular visit that yeah. I was due for. Who's your dentist? Uh, Dr. Craig Marshall. Okay, all right. And uh, I mentioned it to him. I said, uh, you know, my jaw is real sore and it's hard to open up all the way. Uh -huh. And he said, well, it's probably just from clenching. And I don't know, uh, he didn't seem to be too concerned with it. Okay. So then after, a, a, I don't know, a couple months or so, then my ear started uh, ringing and hurting. I mm -hmm. mean, real, real bad enough for me to go to see my ear doctor. So when he said uh, ringing, that was Dr. Burroughs. When he said ringing and hurting real bad, like give me an example. You just sound like what? It would. Well, I'd have to take some ibuprofen or something just to calm it down. And I just the ear really couldn't take it. Okay. Would the ringing get better with ibuprofen then? Yeah. Uh, it was just a sharp. Uh, a little bit of rain in, but more of a sharp pain. Okay, pain in the ear. Yeah. Okay. The same side, right side? Same side, same mm -hmm. right side. So I went to see my uh, ear, nose, and throat, Dr. Burroughs. He's a specialist. Huh? And uh, he looked it over and looked in my ear and looked in my throat because I had uh, you know, surgery a long time ago. Mm -hmm. uh, and then he said, uh, well, try to take some leave. Mm -hmm. A regiment of a, a leave, two leaves for, for six weeks or something. Two and then not at night for two weeks. Two weeks, okay. So then I went back to him. Well, I, I called and mm -hmm. I said, uh, "There's no difference. You know, it's not doing nothing." Okay. And he says, "Okay, well, go see Dr. Ramon." Mm -hmm. And uh, so here I am. Okay. So when you first came here, it's been three months ago. And uh, what were your, uh, uh, I think you and Lynn both came. Yeah. So tell me about what you thought when you came and uh, what uh, made sense or did not make any sense. Well, when we first got here, we, uh, you know, actually I had still had the pain mm -hmm. and uh, you sat down with us and, uh, you know, after doing small observation, you uh, kind of showed us what the jaw has uh -huh. a lot to do with uh, a lot of functions in your body right and uh, being uh, not being a strong or lined up yeah you know, oh you mentioned like you you said mentioned like you used to run out of gas and you can't pick up yeah, anything i get fatigued really easy. got it and you have a heavy uh, hard hard work you yeah, don't have an easy right. desk job by any means so uh you explained that very well and uh and we went on with more tests. And mm -hmm. That's when we measured your muscles and all that. Yeah, and we did talk some more. <laughs> great shock treatment. <laughs> so, um, yeah, but it's improved. But um, then we talked about the different options, right? Either leave it be or do something for 90 days. Right. We were at it almost 90 days. Right. So tell me about the what. The first phase was you know, measuring everything and seeing if you could do anything for mm -hmm. us, for me. And then 
we went over the options of, uh, you know, either just stop here and live with the pain or go with the, uh, the treatment for 90 days. And so that's where we're at right now. How do you feel? I feel uh, a lot better. Uh, okay, you put 80% on your yeah, symptoms. Uh, Every, every once in a while, I'll have a little nagging uh, jaw pain, but I mean, mm -hmm. it's not every day at all. So, uh, so it's improving a lot. Okay. And we also check your neck and check your pushing various areas. If they used to be sore, they're not sore anymore? Uh, no, not. Most of it's uh, calmed down uh, mm -hmm. quite a bit. I see. Um, anything else you could tell people that are possibly having all this ear pain and kind of symptoms? Well, I had uh, no idea that, you know, a physical therapist had, uh, was a, a player in uh, the role of the jaw and what the jaw But once you got the jaw right first, teeth. then I also worked with the physical therapist to get that straightened out. Yeah. So. All right. So was it surprising to you that uh, uh, it Putting the jaw in the right together. place would help with that much of a difference. And you mentioned about how you can pick up heavier stuff, like big yeah. rocks and stuff. Yeah, I can. Uh, I can tell I can lift lift more than. You're more balanced. Yeah. So, All right, sir. Well, thank you so much, Stan. It was a pleasure to meet you and take care of you. Okay. Thank. Thank you.